Hey, what's going on? This is Jordan Widener with PremierGuitar.com here to tell you about the new Scarlett Screamer 70 amp head from Paul Marchman of Scarlett Amps. Now, Scarlett Amps is based out of Kansas City, and they've built some really neat heads. Uh, the Dark Heart head, which is kind of their, it, it's kind of in the vein of a uh, of a Master Volume Marshall head. Um, the uh, the Lead 50 and a couple other amps right now, including also the Screamer 20 combo. Uh, the Screamer 70 is Paul's new flagship amp, and it's 70 watts, two 6550 power tubes, and three 12AX7 preamp tubes. Uh, they're all hand-built, Kansas City, by Paul himself, and this particular one right here has a three-band EQ for bass, mid, and treble, uh, a very, very, very effective presence control, super sensitive, uh, master volume, and a preamp gain control. And the amp tonally is very uh, clear and crisp. Uh, it's very, very high gain, but you can hear every note in every chord. The Screamer 70 is kind of a new thing for Paul and Scarlet Amps. The whole concept came to him from basically younger kids and uh, seasoned players who were tired of playing the same type of high gain heads all the time, and they wanted something a little new, something a little bit more unique to kind of separate them from the pack. So that's what the Screamer 70 is designed to do. It's just a no-holds-barred high-gain amp. There really isn't any clean to speak of on it at all, and that is by design. Paul specifically mentioned that it's just designed specifically to rip your face off. So, and it does that extremely well with a great tone, very, very punchy, very, very clear. So I'm going to play some stuff for you right now using a 1978 Gibson Les Paul Custom with Tom Anderson pickups through this Emperor 4x12 cabinet with four Weber speakers. <laughs> Now the Screamer 70 does some pretty cool low gain stuff too. Um, this is about as much as it'll clean up from rolling down the volume knob. You can get a little bit more grit out of it. So you can kind of tell just from the tone right there that it's very smooth and very rounded on the top. It's uh, just a great overall guitar tone. Uh, it's kind of kind of a one-trick pony. It's not the most versatile amplifier in the world, but what it does, it does extremely well. And it's probably one of the coolest amps I've come across in a very long time. So here I'm going to demonstrate a little bit about what I was talking about before, about how you can hear each note in the chord very, very well. Probably one of the coolest things about the Scarlet Screamer 70 is the presence control. Now, on most amps, the presence, presence control just kind of adds more of a high-end cut to the amp. Um, but with the Screamer 70, it reacts a lot more differently. You can read uh, more of the technical details of it in my written review uh, in our print edition and also online at PremierGuitar.com. It can drastically affect the tone of the amp and the response and the feel. The higher the presence control goes, the more gain and volume and definition and punch that you get. So if you want kind of a softer tone, kind of a little bit more laid back in the vein is easy top, then it's the Screamer 70 is certainly capable of that, but it's still keeping with its aggressive nature. So right now I'm got the presence control again at zero and I'm going to start playing a few riffs and just put it at different areas going up towards the maximum so you can kind of get an idea of what I'm talking about.
So there you have it. That's the Scarwood Screamer 70 from Scarwood Amps. The amp is a little over $1,800 for the head. Uh, they're custom built to order. It is a production model, but they are built to order uh, out of Kansas City by again Paul Marchman. Uh, it's just an amazing high gain head. I love the feel of it. I love the sound of it. I kind of wish there was a little bit more versatility in the range of getting like, you know, actual cleans out of it, but it's not really what it was designed to do. And for what it was designed to do, it does it extremely well. So you can get more information online at scarwoodamps.com and read my full written review at premierguitar.com in our October issue. Uh, this is Jordan Wagner and you've been watching premierguitar.com.